tell me about the night of the parachutings. One of my managers, Delphine Ferre, um, who, who I knew, when I, first I found out that there was a shooting at a concert. I'm like, that's crazy, right? Then I learned that it's an Eagles of Death Metal concert, and I'm like, oh no, because I've been to three Eagles of Death Metal concerts with Delphine in Paris. I know that she's at every Eagles of Death Metal concert in Paris. So I'm suddenly trying to reach out to Delphine. And uh, there's no answer. Da, da, da. I reach out to her husband. And he's like, he, he says, she just got home. It's like, she was at the concert. She just got home. We'll talk soon. She's here. It's OK. So I spoke to Delphine yesterday, actually. And, um, and Delphine had uh, a life changing experience because she was on the terrace outside of the Bataclan. She's at a table for three on like the sidewalk outside and that's where they shoot first. So immediately the guy across from her she's talking to like shot in the head, he's, don't, he's dead. Then the guy next to her, bullet comes through his back and out of his chest he falls over and she sees everybody dive down on the ground. She dives down with everybody else, grabs her friend Who's, who's bleeding from the chest. But she stays still and she sees the, the, the boots walk past her and the guns walk past her and over her into the, the club. And she hears what's going on there. And, uh, and so in the meanwhile, she, uh, she's expecting everybody else to get up and kind of run. And she notices that the people around her who, who dove down didn't dive down. They've all been shot but her friend who's been shot in the chest is still breathing. He is recovering. Or no, he's recovering, um, which means a lot to her because she, like I said, she has this huge, why me now? Why me? Why is she, you know, this, the only survivor of the people who's, who are out there on that terrace, you know? At that point as a friend, you, you listen. Yeah. There's not much you can say.